my co-panelists and to your viewers as well. It is heartwarming to, for once, uh, know that uh, an institution is working and working expeditiously. From the civil society and also anti-corruption perspective, we believe this is very, very timeless. And then also, if you remember the last time I mentioned that it is not just about what has been uncovered, what about what hasn't been. Today, we are all hearing that the OSB's office made a significant discovery, which they want the court to then help them to continue to freeze. We think that is very good for us, apart from helping them to continue to freeze, they would also then, they are talking about other accounts that even go beyond what they have located. And so it means that at this particular time, we are particularly happy that this is going on. And we only urge that more of this should happen. And not just for the OSP, but also within and without the anti-corruption space, so that will make significant gains for this country. What we are all seeking is the truth, and if the truth is then found, uh, the OSP in going to court will then determine if the assets are also indeed frozen, then it means it gives them more time to delve into other aspects of this case. And we believe it is very good in the fight against corruption. Another thing I wanted to 